part of the the problem in in in, in all of those issues, if you offshore, is still that there's people pushing for what's called the scope three accounting, which is like, you know, you got to go back to your supplier and your supplier, supplier, totally. and your supplier, supplier, supplier. And where does it end? It's impossible. Where does it end? It's, it's it's not credible. So, you know, I think that the bill has actually cleaned up a lot of future question marks about what we have to do as a country to go about doing our part for climate change. And I think it probably creates a reasonable blueprint for everybody else. And now they're going to have to do some version of the same thing. And what's amazing is that if we actually pass this framework, which is still yet to be written, uh, around how to make permitting more seamless and efficient for these hydrocarbon projects, it will really unleash um, a massive torrent of both revenues back to the United States. Um, it'll increase our national security. Um, and it'll allow us to really kind of put a dent in this thing because it'll pull forward the amount of uh, competition that it creates to actually get off those hydrocarbons, which is a. I'll tell you, I got 